Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how you can move shapes inside CapCut PC like you do in After Effects. So let's get started. First I have this background. I will just go to text and add a default text right here. Then simply increase its length like this. Delete the default text and press Windows and Dot key at the same time. This will open this emojis and symbol section. In the symbol section scroll down and select a scare like I do. Then simply increase the font size until it fits the screen. Then right click on this, create it into a compound clip. Once the compound clip is ready, go to video and mask and add a rectangle mask like this. Now first, first one, I will just change this rectangle to a circle. So how we can do that, then select all these keyframes and move a few frames where you want the animation to end. And then simply just increase the round corners like this. So it will give us this animation. If you want to make it more smooth, right click on the keyframe, show all presets and then select cubic ease. Or so you can select cubic out like this. Now if you want to make the same like this, I will just simply delete this keyframe and move it here. Now I want from this rectangle to... Uh, from this scale to rectangle so how can we do that i will just select this go to mask and i will make the roundness to something like zero then i will just simply drag this and like this and then just move it right here simply place it here then i will just simply scale it down and just make it here as you can see you can simply create these scares and I will just simply bring it here so these are our final animations you can just right click on this show all presets and next the cubic out or you can slip cubic keys and now if you want to change this circle if you want to change this circle I will just copy this layer and paste it right above like this now if you want to change this like this i will move it here now if you want to change the circle into a rectangle how can we do that just simply go again to mask and then mask section then select all the keyframes move a few frames forward where our animation ends and uh, like this here and then i will just go again into mask i will simply just decrease the round corners and just make it like this and then simply scroll it down to something this and as you can see our other shape is also created so i will just show all presets then cubic out like this now you can go to video and then basic and place it wherever you want to mm, like this so this is a morphing in CapCut. you can use many shapes as you want now for the final touches i will go to facts and add a, a glow 2 to this and then simply make it like this simply increase glow size and like this and our final animation will be looking like this you can just simply make the animation longer it's like cubic out and then for this too i will select cubic out like this so that's it for today if you found this video helpful make sure to like and subscribe to my channel and i will see you in the next one until then take care and bye